Today we're going to take a look at this 7 port USB-C hub from Basius that has dual HDMI output at 4K, 60Hz and 30Hz USB-C and even a VGA port. I'm going to try it on with my MacBook Pro, a portable monitor and even my iPad and see how this thing works. Okay, let's quickly unbox it. There's a little tab here. So we'll just put it off. Warranty card, user manual, and uh, we got the main unit. It's a very, very compact. Look at this. It has a little light indicator. So on the left side, we have 100 watts power delivery input, uh, USB. Um, this is HDMI 4K at 60 hertz, 4K at 30 hertz. VGA output. I no longer have VGA, these analog monitors anymore. It has three USB ports. This one in blue color is a USB 3.0. 2.0, 2.0. Okay, let's try it on. So if your laptop does not have a HDMI output, this is the way to do it. So you can connect it to a portable monitor. For Mac users, you cannot get two HDMI output out of it. Uh, this is really designed, two HDMI outputs is going to be meant for uh, Chromebooks or Windows users. So I'm going to connect it to the KYY portable 4K monitor. And I'm going to power the monitor using a, a, HD, uh, Type-C port. And it should be, become available in just a few seconds. Yes, it is on. Now if I open a window, I should be able to drag my window across it. And then if I wanna try it with my iPad, I can, I can do that as well. Uh, let me do this. Since my iPad Pro has a Type-C output, in this setup, I think I should be how, yeah, I'm able to cast the iPad screen onto this 15.6 inch monitor. And additionally, it doesn't matter if I'm using iPad or the uh, MacBook Pro, I can always use the USB-C cable for providing power supply. And I believe the iPad will have access to all these USB ports that uh, allows data access. For example, I can connect a microphone to my iPad and use, it, uh, use thumb drives to access the file system from the uh, thumb drive. Okay, this way, as you can see, I am charging the iPad Pro uh, seven, uh, 11 inch. And that screen is a mirrored one. I don't have the ability to uh, do extended screen. Okay, this is uh, the way to give your iPad a boost, or um, you know, uh, if you want to do a presentation, this is the way to do it. If you connect it to a projector with the HDMI input, okay. and let's see what happens if I connect my second monitor to this setup. Will it work? I don't know. Let's see. I have another portable monitor connected above. Actually, it has dual output. Look at this. This is crazy. Wow. <laughs> totally unexpected. Um, now I'm going to try my um, MacBook. And of course, I'm going to be charging the MacBook as well in this setup. Uh, I believe these are going to be identical. Yes, it's going to be the same. So I can drag windows across, but these windows are totally duplicated of each other. Very interesting. Yes. Uh, then you need you probably need two of these um, USB-C hubs to connect to two separate extended monitors at the same time. Um, this is um, the limitation of the M1 chip. But if you are using the Chromebook, so let me use this uh, Asus Chromebook. 
let me see if it has power. Yeah, it, it's booting up right now. I can add this screen. I believe it will work. Let me enter my password off the screen. Just a second. Okay, entering my password right now. All right, I am in. I'll connect the USB-C port. And that one should have data as well as uh, the power supply. So that one come, becomes available. The other one is available. Now, if I go to my settings page, see if I'd be able to set, um, get two uh, extended monitors. So the device displays, if I go here, um, yes. I'll position the one on top. Um, let me see if this is duplicated. Yes, that one is extended. I'm gonna open a window so I can I can be sure. This is Chromebook. Uh, can I go up? Yes, I think we have three. Yeah, dual monitors. This is dual extended monitors. This is possible. Yes, it is. This is totally possible using the um, uh, USB-C hub from Basius. Very, very cool. Yeah, highly, highly recommended. This is uh, probably the most cost-effective way to get your uh, dual monitor set up and have some USB access, have the laptop charged, have the iPad charged, yeah, something like that. Okay, thanks for watching. Hope you find this review helpful.